Hey, what's up guys? I'm Alan from Premiere Pro Tips and today I'm just going to be going over how to use green screens in Adobe Premiere Pro so that you can do all of those mind-blowing <laughs> video tricks. Um, so basically I just went on YouTube, I found some green screen footage and it's just a car. It's actually it's not even a video, it's just a picture but the, it'll work the same either way. So, first thing you want to do is you want to take your green screen footage and set it on video 2. The reason why I'm setting it on video 2 is because video 1 needs to be saved for for whatever footage we want to be replacing the green. So, I'm going to click on the green screen footage and then I'm going to go into the effects panel video effects and then um, keying and then color key and you're just gonna click and drag color key and drop it on top of your green screen footage another way that you can uh, find the effect is just to go in the search bar right here search color key and as you can see it's right there so pick your poison <laughs> so once we've applied the effect then we need to um, be more specific for the effect so you click the drop down arrow under color key and then you need to choose the color so you want to click on the eyedropper and you want to click on the green so we have the green selected and then I'm going to scoot this over so you guys can see um, so there's color tolerance edge thin and edge feather so these can all three of these can be used in order to get rid of the green so first color tolerance this means how much of the green um, is basically going to be tolerated like how much is going to be taken away and whatnot so you just want to get it pretty close because if you go too far let me just show you really quick uh, if you go too far see it starts taking away other stuff so you want to keep it within reason so 52 looks about good now you can still see a little green around the edges but that's fine because next we have edge thin what edge thin does is it just takes away the edges of the green and then edge feather this just feathers it if that's what you want to do so that looks about good once you see all the green gone and then I've just got some random footage that's running behind it um, you can put any video footage and even though this shows that it's black right here this will be whatever video footage you want to put underneath it and um, this works for other colors other than just green if you have a blue screen red screen what whatever color you're working with you can key it out by using color keying. So if you have any questions, please let me know, um, either through private message or by leaving a comment. And I'll try my best to get back with you and help you fix your problem. So um, please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, I really appreciate it. You can check out my website in the description for more videos. And yeah, this has been Alan with Premiere Pro Tips, and thanks.